Good morning, guys. I hope you're having an amazing day. In this side of the screen, the building continues, and today it's time to finish doing these footers. In the last video, I made two of them, and right now, today, I'm gonna finish the rest of them. Forty two point five kilos. Here we go. Maybe some of you are thinking why I don't use a concrete mixer to mix this concrete. Well, per now I want to try to do as much work with my hands as I can. And making this thing is pretty easy, it's not that hard. The hard part is to carry the materials from the top to the hill to the bottom here. But everything else is easier. But in the future, when I start doing the footers for the house, we will probably get a concrete mixer because it's gonna be a lot of concrete and it's gonna be a lot of work if I do it by hand but in this case for this little thing I can do it by hand We had this meeting the other day and I asked for more responsibilities here on the farm and guess what? I got these babies! They're gonna be my responsibility from now instead. I'm gonna be working with them, feeding them, taking care of them. The guys are gonna do the part side uh, cleaner stuff but I'm gonna be taking care of them most of the time. Hi George! What's up bro? Silly? Yeah. Just like this. Guys, let the corn. Let's go. And then we have Basilius, who almost never wants to walk, and he prefers me to carry him. Are you comfy there? You feel comfy? Yeah. <laughs> this is a classic. It always works. The food is their weakness. All the footers are done now, as you can see, and it's almost noon, so it's lunch time, and I'm gonna go to prepare some lunch. All right, I'm back. And now that the footers are all ready, the next step is start placing some cariolas of those ones, single cariolas, from here to there and making like a square all the way around in the inside of the caballos, the metal beams. And that is gonna be used to place other cariolas that are gonna come in the way up are gonna be welded to that piece of metal there and are gonna come up until the top of the next beam that is gonna be from there to there
I still have to weld those metal beams in the place where they need to go but that's gonna be tomorrow because tomorrow is the welding day And from here is where I'm gonna call this a day. In this nice and beautiful bed. I just got the mattress. It's a foam mattress. It doesn't have springs on it. I put this beautiful blanket over it. And with the time, I'm gonna get a piece of memory foam and I'm gonna put it over this. So it's gonna be even more comfy. And I have to confess something. I haven't sleep in a bed since like two months and a half ago but I'm not gonna sleep alone here look who is here it's a rush so tonight he's gonna sleep with me I need a cat to cuddle and he was just there I grabbed him and we are gonna sleep together morning guys oh i feel like new i really needed to sleep in a bed like this ah it's so comfy i love it but look at this it's the best part waking up and having this view of the nature right at my side is just it's a great feeling it's a very very good feeling Look, it's been a beautiful day and I need to start with my morning routine, so let's start it. Good morning, girls. How are you, babies? Come on. Oh, you ready to go and play? Yes. I really like this new hat, it protects me from the sun. I like it, it's nice. As I told you, today it's welding day, but there is something that is stopping me to continue. And it's basically that this welder that I'm gonna use for some reason is not working. Maybe it could be like an electrical problem or something. So it is fixed now and the problem was basically a little wire who was not set in the right spot. So Jordan said, you just need to move this here, put this here and that's it. Dude, I had like 20 minutes before trying to figure out what was the problem. He just came, just moved this, this and that and then it was working. It was like... By the way, Jordan, if you're watching this, thanks bro. This is actually a great trick that I learned from Kaylee in Jordan. Tagging the piece first and then when you have it tagged, you can finish the weld. Woohoo! The first one is done and I discovered that I really like to weld. Dude, the feeling when you're welding, nothing is good.
it's been a little bit cold it's not raining but the breeze that comes from the north feels very very cold uh, I had to put my jacket on but well now I have these pieces already well in the place all of them are in the place and the next step is to start working in the caballos that are gonna go in this part in this area and they're actually those ones that are there so I need to weld them together and start placing them all the way up from there to there Alright, the welding part is done and now I just need to cut these beams and place them up there. Can I use your ladder? This one? Yeah. You gotta ask the ladder boy. I think he's dead. You still alive, bro? Kake, are you alive? Why you turn the light on? <laughs> <laughs> Can I use your ladder, ladder boy? What for? What are you gonna do? Uh. I'm gonna weld some beams in the top of the shed. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Okay. <laughs> Hi, boys and girls. Do you need a drink? Come on, I brought you some water. This is something that we have to do every time when it is sunny. And it is mainly because they could get dehydrated very easy. For example, this boy right here, Silly, he got dehydrated the other day and he was having a very, very hard time. And we discovered that it was due to he was not getting enough water. And once we start giving him more water, he immediately start feeling better. But this boy here, he's so cute. So far, this is my progress for today. I still have to weld some other beams on the top, but the generator ran out of gas and I don't have more gas. I still can go to the town and get more gas, but I know that's gonna take me like one or one hour or one and a half hour because I can get dis distracted with every single thing so what I'm gonna do is call this my working day and start working in a side project that has been waiting for me for a long time
yes, this project is inside my treehouse. And it is about rebuilding this wall. Well, basically, it's rebuilding all the walls, including that one. And what I'm gonna do with these boards that I just cut is to put them in the wall and create a wooden wall. So this is the progress that I did. This time, um, as this is a side project, it's gonna take mm, a little longer than the usual. And this side project, it's gonna be one of the most needed things right now for me in this treehouse. All right guys, so from here, from my bed and my treehouse is where I'm gonna say bye to you. Thank you so much for watching this. Thank you for all your amazing support. Love you guys and see you next weekend.